Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. My name is Sarah, also known as Laugh Love Langella. And in today's video, I'm going to share some great everyday decor finds from McGee & Co. A couple of these I've already styled throughout places in my home, as you guys have seen, and a couple of them are new as well. But these are just great staple decor pieces that you can use all year round, so you really get the most bang for your buck out of these items. So let's get right into it. So the first one today, I feel like you can never go wrong with a great staple candle holder. I got these beautiful twisted iron ones recently and I have them styled out on our entryway table. I shared that in my summer decorating video, but I just love the simple style lines of these. These obviously go with literally everything and I really like the footed tripod detail as well. So that way they still are substantial and make a statement but are dainty at the same time. They're not super clunky looking or anything, but love these so much. I got both sizes of them. I normally like to do things in a trio, but sometimes it can get a little overwhelming on the space. Like my entry table, for example, is on the smaller side. So I kind of need to approach it in a less is more way, but these are really great. And I just love the style lines of them so much. The next item, Super big statement. So many of you guys love this one as well. It is quite a splurge item. I did shop their Memorial Day sale and that's when I picked it up. So, and I've had my eye on this for so, so long. It is the Antonia vase from McGee & Co. I did end up getting the large size of it. This year they did make a smaller one as well. I have that on my wish list, but one thing at a time. And what I really love about this, for one, it is so much bigger than I thought it was. You could tell in other people's photos and through social media, it definitely is a statement vase. However, you really don't get the true perspective of how large this actually is until you see it in person. And I'm really fine with that. I love a big statement vase and especially at this price point, it's worth it because it is so huge. You do have to keep in mind if you're going to use this for shelf styling or something, this is very, very wide. So most standard depth shelves are 12 inches deep. This absolutely will not fit on it. I don't know about the smaller one because I don't personally own that one. But something else that I really like about this is that there is a glass insert inside of it. So if you are somebody that likes to decorate with real florals, you can actually add some water in this and put some real florals beautifully styled. It also makes it really easy when you are styling your florals in a very large vessel. A great tip to better arranging them and keeping them a little bit more together is actually putting a smaller vase or jar something of the sort inside of your vessel. So that way you have a little bit more structure in your arrangement. So I think it's great because if you love real florals, obviously that is its intended purpose, but it works just as well when it comes to styling your faux ones. But this one, even at the splurge, I think is absolutely worth it. McGee & Co does do a very good job of having sales fairly frequently. They actually right now have their summer sales. So they have up to 70% off on their website. I don't think any of the items I'm sharing today are part of it. I will have everything linked down below for you guys. So if you would like to shop any of these, but I will also just link the website so you can check out their summer sale because they have some really, really great pieces at really affordable prices right now. The next item that is a really great staple from them, I am a sucker for certain things. Candles, easels, and pedestals. They seem to be my weakness. I don't know what it is about them, but I like having lots of options. So that way, no matter what direction I wanna go, I can have plenty to play with. So the simplicity of this McGee & Co easel I think is just so beautiful 
It lets the art have its own moment. It is not super busy looking. It also makes it easier if you are styling this on a shelf or console table. You can do more layers with some books and smaller objects next to it and not have the whole space be overwhelming. So I did pick this one up a few months ago now. This is the small size. But then McGee and Co actually gifted me a couple items as well. This video is not sponsored by them or anything. This is just part of their creator program, but I did get the large one from them. So just so you guys can see a more direct size comparison, this one is the small and then the large one is to this size. I just think that they are so, so perfect. I love the modern look of it. When it comes to my decorating style, I don't exactly know where I would box myself, but I love mixing modern, rustic, organic type of items with each other. And I like having some more rustic elements next to a more modern piece such as this. So these are really great. You can use them all year round for whatever type of art, your children's artwork, frame it, give them a canvas is a great summer activity as well and just have something on display for you guys. So I love those easels, highly recommend. And I will say that these are very substantial. Sometimes when you get an item like this at a big box store or something, things are crooked. They're not exactly perfectly set in each other. So they're kind of wobbling around. These are very, very sturdy and absolutely worth it. So. I, they have a great, great value. The weld is very nicely done. It's not sloppy. And those are the little things that will absolutely get under my skin and bother me relentlessly. So those I actually pay attention to. Those types of things matter. And I just love those easels. They are super great. The next couple of things Biggie & Co. also sent to me and this is actually something that I was really wanting as well, was one of their little pedestal trays. So they have round ones and they also have rectangular ones. So no matter what space you're trying to style, you can find something that best suits it. I did opt to get the smallest size of the round one. It has great character on the wood and it's just got the three feet on the bottom, but I apologize, this is all very dusty. We are redoing our floors right now and it's kind of spiraled into other things downstairs and it's a bit of a construction zone, hence the shift in the camera angle because I can only make things look so nice. <laughs> but I digress. These are great everyday styling pieces. Sometimes you just need a little corral for a vase or your soap dispensers next to a sink. You can do it on your kitchen island if you want one of the bigger ones. I did opt to get the smaller ones so that way I could use it in kitchen styling and not take up a lot of countertop space. But I also figured this would be really fun on this other side of my bathroom vanity and style it one of, with one of these other vases that they sent me as well. These are a new item. They are these ribbed glass vases. So this is the cylinder one. And then they're whoop, big reach. There is also a round one. I would not call these a true bud vase because they are definitely a little bit larger than that. But I love the simplicity of these again all year round. And I appreciate that it is not a color. So that way it doesn't feel fall because it's more of that rust type of amber or green. I tend to go more in like a Christmas winter direction. Some greens you really can use all year round. I think green is a good neutral, but I think that these are so great. You can put real florals, you can put fake florals. We finally, finally, I deadheaded our hydrangeas, I wanna say a year and a half ago and I do not have a green thumb, as many of you know, and I definitely deadheaded them at the wrong time of the year. So last year, we did not have a single hydrangea bloom 
on any of them. And it was so, so sad. So came fall and winter, I did not touch them. I didn't do a single thing to them. I didn't want to mess with them. I was just crossing my fingers and hoping for the best. And we got some beautiful, huge blooms on two of them. The other two, I haven't seen anything quite yet, but I'm still holding out hope that they're going to come back. Those tend to be a more hardy perennial in the mix, but I thought that it would be so beautiful because there's this beautiful dark, uh, there's a dark blue bush and there's a light blue. And so that way I can kind of pick the best blooms from them and style these in our bathroom downstairs. So it really pops off that dark green color. So I thought these were great. These are also super affordable. These were only $16 on McGee & Co, which is very, very reasonably priced. I think that just is very comparable to Hobby Lobby, Target, all those types of stores. Definitely love these and they are a thick glass too. They don't feel super thin and dainty. Obviously they are glass, so please proceed with caution. But I thought it would just be such a cute styling moment next to the sink on the other side of the soap to just have a little something to add some life into the space. So that is going to wrap up today's video, friends. There are definitely more great everyday decor items on McGee & Co's website. This is just personally what I already own, so that's why I just wanted to talk about those. But I will link some of my other favorite items from them that I have my eye on down below in the video description so you guys can check it out too if you need some more inspiration or ideas. If you have any of these items as well and you love them, be sure to share it in the comments. It always helps everyone out to just get a better idea of more opinions when it comes to these things. As always, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me here today and I will see you in my next video, friends. Bye.